Hey there guys, Fireman Official here and welcome to this Age of Empires 4 video and today we're completing the Normans campaign missions. It's the Second Battle of Lincoln, the year is 1217. The succession of a child king left England vulnerable to revolt. Its protection fell to an aging knight and a female sheriff. When forces loyal to King John undermined Rochester Castle, it spelled doom for the rebels inside. Within days, they had surrendered. But the rebel barons weren't done yet. Their ally, Prince Louis of France, had sent an invasion force to help the barons overthrow King John. Then, in late 1216, the king fell ill with dysentery and died. His son, just nine years old, was crowned King Henry III. It was now up to the young king's regent, the 70-year-old legendary knight William Marshall, to protect the crown. He faced a near impossible challenge. England was crumbling. Rebels were taking town after town. But William Marshall bided his time and prepared to defeat the rebels. Then in May 1217, he got the chance that he'd been waiting for. William discovered that the rebels planned to simultaneously besiege both Dover Castle and Lincoln Castle. With rebel forces split and weakened, William Marshall led his royalist army to Lincoln. The castle on one side of the city was still controlled by royalists under its formidable constable, Lady Nicola de la Haye. But the streets of the city were under rebel control. On May 20th, 1217, the Royalist Relief Force, led by William Marshall, arrived to retake the rebel-controlled city. The future of England rode on the success of this mission. Alright, it's heating up. The Second Battle of Lincoln. Rebel barons and their French allies besieged the castle at Lincoln. The king's knight, William Marshall, was tasked with retaking the city by force. Alright, so uh, looks like we're going to have to uh, face off against the, um, the French as well, the rebel barons and their French allies in this final mission of the Normans campaign. All right, with gameplay tips, constructing multiple military production buildings of the same type allow you to quickly bolster your numbers. Yep, sounds like we're going to need to on this one. All right, let's go. Troops loyal to the king held the castle at Lincoln, while outside, rebels controlled the city. The defenders had to hold the castle until reinforcements arrived under the command of the King's Knight, William Marshall. Okay, we've got some villagers here. Defend Lincoln Castle until William Marshall arrives. A lumber camp there, so we'll use that. Uh, let's get some knights. Um, Arch range, so let's get some longbows, shall we? Longbows are always good to defend the walls with. What are we up against? The thing we need to worry about is rams, really, to be honest. Everything else we can pretty much deal with, I think. Oh, we're pretty okay here. Doesn't look like we've got a town centre, so let's just keep producing. Uh, what's going on here? It's a bit of... well, it's a town centre, but we don't have control of it, so... I guess maybe... well, we've just got to wind down this timer I suppose just wait until William Marshall comes In the meantime we'll just keep producing longbowmen to defend ourselves and we'll see what's coming our way okay, one night so far 
Oh dear, okay. You're these guys to say that. Another night. Alright, what's coming our way? Oh, there's a ram there, actually. So we're going to have to think about taking out that ram. And um, we'll on those. Let's go, let's go. Get the units first, and then once we get the units out, we can venture forward with our knights and... Oh, we'll probably go now, to be honest. We've got quite a lot. Let me just get rid of this ram. We can being pushed from anywhere else? No, just here. Yeah, we can take care of that. Right. Four minutes left. Uh, why are these villagers idle? Well, there's no wood, so where do we go? I mean, wood out here, I guess. Do we get that wood? A bit exposed, I have to say. Alright, come around this side now. Let's go, let's get rid of these. Let's get rid of the rams. To be fair, the longbowmen are going to deal with it anyway, so... Surprisingly enough. Right, not too bad. Keep getting longbows. Probably get longbows from here as well, to be honest. Well, there we want. We want the knights. We want the... There's another push coming on here. As long as there's no mangonels, we're pretty much okay. Uh, we want to get the spears to work. No, we don't want the spears to go on the knights. Oh, there are mad at arms there, though. There's a spear as well. Oh, there's one there. Right, let's just get rid of that once we can. Go on that side now. We can just snipe this ram and then go back in with the man at arms. No real need to commit too much here. Get rid of that ram. And then we can go back in. Oh, we can get rid of that ram as well, actually. And get sprinkled. Pull up my arms, I guess. The king's men discovered a building belonging to the rebels. To secure Lincoln, they would need to destroy the rebels' military structures. Okay. We slowly make our way. Well, probably is there's quite a lot of units here still coming out. If we can snipe this uh, ram, it would be useful for us. Get some of these military buildings down, that should help us a lot. Okay, we're actually out of food, so we don't want to spend too much, because we need, we're need we going to need food. Oh, what's going on here? Uh, we don't want to take that fight unnecessarily. Go down with our longbows, I guess. Damn, that spring order was a bit crazy. Uh, uh oh, oh, don't want to fight the spears. Okay, let's get that. Get rid of that. Anything else coming our way? No, it doesn't look really like it. Okay, what else have we got? Oh, there's gold there. Let's go around. Get this military building. Let's get these guys first. Oh, 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 that's such a crap there. Oh, there's more rams there. Stop that first. Don't want to get caught out here. At last, 
The King's Knight William Marshall arrived with nice. his forces. While a hard battle remained, there was now hope for the young King's army. Wow, look at us a lot of army. Get rid of the town centre. Well, that's not really a building we need to get rid of, but... Now we're population capped, so... Oh, not anymore. William Marshall's forces were welcomed in Stowe, a nearby town loyal to the king. Okay, let's get... Oh, we're saving the game. All right, but it's good that we've got another town centre now. Right, we can just keep producing units. We'll go to gold with that one. Um, we'd quite like to have some more stone. Is there any more stone anywhere? Oh, lost a lot there. Damn, that spring was... Damn, that spring was causing a lot of damage. Lost... Wait. Alright, okay. I thought we just lost all those knights. That would have been terrible. Uh, hang on. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, alright. Yeah, okay. I got the hint. I got the hint. We'll get back. We do not want to fight against that manga now with the archers or the long bowmen. Okay, now we can go. Get the springholds. Now let's go. Let's go, let's go this way. That way. Back. Where's that? I thought there was a military unit. There there is. Get the gold though. Oh, wait, are we being pushed somewhere? Oh, for goodness sake, man. The king's men tore through the rebel fortifications, diminishing the enemy's military presence. We will need to finish the mid though. The castle now faced a new attack uh -oh. from the rebels' French allies. That's not good. Get rid of the military buildings first, and then see what's... Oh, There's not actually that much coming out there. I don't, I don't think we have to worry too much just yet. Oh, well, wow. okay. Oh my god, there's more there, though. Okay, I understand that. Using siege, damn it. Let's get rid of these guys. Charge! Let's get rid of them guys, I guess. Um, we get the gold mining upgrade, maybe? Do we need well, it's quite a lot of gold for that? What about this? A lot of gold we need for that as well. Okay, got that building. Had almost regained control of the city. If the king's men hoped to lift the French siege, they would need to destroy the enemy forts on the outskirts of Lincoln. Well, that ram's dead anyway, so that's fine. Uh, we've got a lot of wood. The king's army raised the last of the rebels' military buildings, but the French siege continued. Okay, get rid of the French siege now. French siege is what's kind of in the way. And I think now we need to get more stable. A lot on gold though. We'll get four stables, that should be enough. Let's go back to wood. We just need a lot of food here. Do we have a market? 
Mm, I was wondering whether I should get another town centre. We need 400 stone for town centre. Jeez, it's quite expensive. More expensive than I thought it would be. Yes, we go there. Producing. You need a lot more food though. What about agriculture? Wow, we need a lot of gold for this stuff. And to get to the next. Wow. Oh, what's that? Houses there. Let's get full scale production, I think, and we'll get pop capped to 200, and then we should be able to just wipe everything out, I think. Need for just to go to gold anymore. We should need more wood actually. More wood so we can get more farms. More knights? Oh, can we get that? What do we need? We need the Imperial Age for that though. Wait, is my third town center up? Yep, yep, it is. Okay, produce, produce, produce. Hey, wait, and that one as well. Okay, yeah. Oh wait, whoops. We don't want scouts. What knights? How many villages we've got? We've got. We've got. We've only got 39, 40 villages. We need a lot more. We want to keep up knight production here. Oh, wow. Okay. We'll get this through the spring order, I think. The knights. More village. What we need. And they're pretty expensive knights, I suppose. The question is if we go in period age, we get the upgrades, but I think just numbers should be fine. Getting good production now. Good production. Rush that. Good production. 140 population. 
Let's get some archers, uh, longbowmen as well, I guess. Get longbows as well. Alright, booming away, getting lots of production. Almost be able to be able to afford a fifth stable to be honest, but probably no more. I don't think we've already got five stables, but it feels like it anyway. One, two, yeah, we've got five producing. Nice. Might be the uh this thing. Keep yeah, it is the keep. Massive army now. Okay, I think we can go forward now. I mean, I know we're not pop capped, but I mean, come on. Let the Lombos do their trick. Go for the keep, keep producing here. Yeah. We'll get pop capped very soon now, anyway. Okay, let's follow the road. Okay, I guess we go down here in the south. Get rid of the southern port. The king's men uncovered one of the French forces siege camps near Lincoln. It's actually a problem with the Mangano actually, because it's hard to fight. With the Mangano there. Let's get in. Get in. We need to get the Manganel essentially. That's all we need. If we get the Manganel, we should be fine. If we get the Manganel. I think so. Okay, now we can just kite stuff and let Longbows do their trick. Well, it comes from that side as well. Very sneaky. Really spinned. Okay. Uh, where are these eight villages? Critical. Now, I guess. Let's get rid of these buildings. I think we need some archery rangers, to be honest. Southern Fort almost done, I think. These two houses, I guess. The King's army tore through the French fort, weakening the enemy siege. Okay, nice. We've got to go to the other star now, the uh, Eastern Fort.
What? Random ram there. That's a lot of ammo there. Let's go. That stuff will just get destroyed in the same. How do we get across? Oh, right, there's a bush there. Oh, we run out of gold. Okay. Uh, anywhere gold? Oh, there's gold there. I don't think we'll need it, but yeah. I mean, we could probably buy our way up to the next stage here. With how much food we've got. Um, we can unqueue these and get to the next stage, I would have Let's go forward. I don't know if that's just a distraction we even need to fight this to be honest. Yeah, I can imagine that's fine. Let's go up the road. Especially with this number of long bow. Oh, what are these spring walls? Let's get rid of the spring walls. Oh, there's a mangonel. Oh, we need to get rid of the mangonel. Okay, we've got rid of the mangonel. We can just chill out here. And let the uh, long bows do the rest. Lost a lot, though. I should have upgraded my units. Melee units and all that. Yeah. I'd be worried about is uh, mangonels. If mangonels to come out now. now. Oh, my love, there's two of them. It's not the mangonels. Light them. What's that? Is that the siege workshop? We need to get rid of the siege workshop, honestly. The workshop's gonna kill us. I'm gonna still there. But. Oh no. Oh no. Look at 
these towers, kind of annoying me. I've got lots of knights there. I mean, how bad would it be if Mangano popped out right now? Okay, I think we've won this now. Get rid of these buildings and I think we're done. Done. Nice. Defeated the French army. William Marshall and Nicola de la Haye had saved the city, and with it, the kingdom. victory pretty cool mission i guess that's the end of the campaign um quite a nice mission to end it with uh, let's see if there's any more cutscenes though oh there is william marshall's success in retaking lincoln was an overwhelming victory for the royalists the rebel barons had been defeated and their french allies driven out of england altogether William Marshall now focused on creating a stable kingdom for the young King Henry III. To maintain the backing of the rebels, in 1217, a royal seal of approval was given to a reissued Magna Carta, limiting the power of the monarchy. Many barons held lands in both England and Normandy, but now they faced a choice. On which side of the channel would they make their home? Many chose England. The cross-channel kingdom was over, establishing a clear English identity. But the impact of the Normans on England's evolution is still felt today. Almost a thousand years later, the surviving Norman castles and cathedrals still dominate the landscape. In the midst of the modern city, William the Conqueror's fortress, the Tower of London, remains a powerful reminder of their legacy. but it's the unseen influence of the Normans that endures. The Norman invasion changed the English language and established the foundations of modern parliament and governance. And it's all because one man, William the Conqueror, claimed the English crown that he believed by rights was his. The Normans conquered a country and changed the course of England forever. Awesome. Pretty cool campaign. And so there you have it, guys. That's the Normans campaign finished, done and dusted. Hope you enjoyed that video and if you did feel free to give it a like it really helps the channel and we're going to move on to the hundred years war which is the next campaign 
And if you'd like to see that campaign, click the right-hand card screen now. And if you'd like to see some build orders for different civilizations, click the left-hand card screen now. Take care, guys, and see you next time.